Hey everybody, welcome back to episode 100 of Rogue Tech Cold Forge. So today we are going to take on a clan mission. Let's just take a look at our mech bays just to make sure everything is repaired and ready to go. There's been a few times in the past where I've made the mistake of thinking things were fixed and they weren't. So uh, let's see here, Mjolnir is up and ready to go. And the Zeus X, I think we're leaving out today. As much as I'd like to take it with us, I don't think... Um, as much as I like that arrow system, I don't think it's going to quite have the firepower we're going to need for this mission. Um, so let's look here now. Uh, I'm really hoping that we don't get smushed on this. But we're going to do redirection. Uh, it's a five skull escort mission. Uh, so let's negotiate this out. It's the first time we're taking the Mjolnir into battle, and we're going to go full salvage. We do have enough for our financial report, plus most likely any repairs that we have to suffer here. So let's accept this. And, okay, so we're going to flush these guys out of here. Okay, so um, Mjolnir is going to go to Pylon because he's been our best melee guy for the longest time. He's got the highest piloting, so he's going to run that. The Annihilator is going back to Cold Metal. I think most likely what I'm going to do, uh, who's going to be the hottest running mech here? Um, most likely it'll be the Mad Cat, I think. So we're going to put the Mad Cat in the hands of Hickory and put the King Crab in recoil. Since recoil doesn't have uh, Warlord, uh, we're going to put Mr. Crabs down here. Um, and we're going to run this and see how we do. I'm really hoping that we don't get smushed on this, but uh, let's deploy and let's get this job done. Okay, so this is an interesting map. Um, like I said, I hope we don't get smushed. So we just got to force our way through here. 80 and 65 tons is kind of a good um, sign, I think, that we're probably not going to get totally smushed. Um, so if you guys have played this map, you'll know how it works. You force your way through these guys here, activate the mechs here. They kind of walk down and head up over here uh, and then get extracted. We've ended up with problems before where the last lance that comes in comes in up here and fires down into the valley. Um, a secondary lance, I'm not sure where they will appear, most likely down in here once we activate the base with the fighter way through them. Um, so yeah, let's get this sucker started. Let's worry about the first lance first, then we'll go from there. So, Pylon, Commander. interested to see how far we can move. Actually, that's not too bad. That's a lot faster than I thought. Um, we're going to do this. I want to get in and see what we're facing here. Um, something like that, I think. So we've got a shit ton of chevrons. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven chevrons of evasion. That's with Phantom Mech on. So we got two turns, 100 ton and a 65. Okay. So we got a Thunderbolt, Warhammer 2C. That guy's definitely dangerous. We need to take him out at long range. Thunderbolt, not so bad. I mean, not as, ba not as bad, definitely, as this guy. So let's just take a couple pot shots on him. It'd be nice to get the haywire on this guy. So we're going to fire. All right, haywire and tag. That's all we really need. Did we get the haywire? Was it the haywire? Wow, a lot of missiles hit there. Did we? What did we get on him? Tagged, no haywire. Heat generation is reduced by 20. Okay, so this guy's got a lot of good stuff on him. All incoming damage reduced by 20. Land standard cockpit. Uh, okay. Receiving. 
All right, we're gonna reserve. I want to see what they do here. Holding for tactical advantage. Could be another thunderbolt. Don't know. Find out soon enough. Looks like we're gonna be punishing this thunderbolt first. Uh, I've got 12 turns of Gauss ammo, so I have to be very careful. I can only use four pretty much on the opening here. Oh. I like them apples. Okay, as long as the PPCs don't hit. Okay, Hickory, let's get in here. See if we can blow this guy up. Fire everything at him. It's a lot of heat, but we're going to deal with it. I need him gone. Okay, gone. That, one's gone. that should be a warning to them that if we can take a 65 ton mech down in with, with two shots, or one turn with two mechs, they had to worry. What the fuck is this guy? Commander. All right, we don't get a shot, but that's okay. We're gonna move in with everybody else. Mr. Krabs is moving in with uh, Phantom Mech next turn. There are other 65 tonner moving forward. So it does look like that's probably going to be another, uh, that's probably going to be another, um, Thunderbolt. Receiving you. Alright, let's see how much damage we can do. Only have one attack point, but, uh, we'll take it. 99% chance to hit, and a lot of other junk is going to have good chances to hit, so let's do this. Copy that. Here it comes, folks. Putting my weight into it. 96. That's it. Oh, he's got 20% reduction. But awesome stability damage. It's almost completely at the end of his bar. Right here. Okay, we're going to phantom mech this and charge straight in. Because I want these guys to be looking at me. Yeah, it's another one of those guys. What do we got back here? A Bane... What the fuck? A Bane Bane? That's a hell of a lot of Ultra 2 auto cannons. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 Ultra 2s. Where are they all located here? Three in the arms. I guess two in each torso. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> sure. Why not? Um, let's drop this guy out of the battle first, if we can. Uh, we're going to shoot everything on him. Let's at least knock his ass on the ground. Head hit. Another head hit. They've got a sensor lock on me. Oh, they do, do they? Is that still in the trees there? It's not. We need to stay in the trees. So let's sprint it over. Trees, 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 please. Warlord confirming that and targeting this guy with everything and firing. Okay, I'm on it. Nice. Got past the arm. Anti gravity arm. Bane, Bane. Where are you going, Bane, Bane? Good thing they're only 20 damage per hit, but it's still that's a lot of hits. That was like what, five hits, six hits? Warning. Armor low. Yeah, that's not good. Bane Bane's gotta go next turn. Fucking Bane Bane, man. Set armor low, but I don't really well, 135 out of 200, I guess. Can't we gotta walk this, we can't sprint it. Just going to move to here. Not the best place to be. 
Um, but let's target this guy and hopefully pull him out of the battle. And fire four. Oh, we took his head off. Okay, two mechs up, two turns, two mechs down. You put yourself in a bad position, buddy. But I need to get the Bane Bane first, so... Waiting for orders. Oh, shit. Okay, we gotta stay outside of... Yeah, we're gonna attack him from this position. Let's do it. Move order received. 120, okay. That's a little better. And he's completely unstable. Okay, recoil. Let's try and put his ass on the ground, please. Um, we'll worry about backshotting that guy in a second. Just going to walk it up. Make sure we had the best chances to hit. And we'll dump everything into him. Okay, he's going down. He's going to get up next turn. Or next. That's okay, though. He's going to have a really bad chance to hit anything. He might try a melee here. Nope. You turkey. That's a lot of hits for being knocked on his ass. Light damage. Holding firm. Okay, you need to cool off. Let's get into here. We're going to do a multi-target here. Um, oh, we can't. Not if we're going to do what I think we're going to do here. So, I want to push this guy back a turn. Uh, we're going to leave the PPCs off. We're going to leave the rack off. We're just pushing him back a turn, so let's just fire the one... Gonna try for the headshot. Um, so if we're gonna do that, just use a PPC if we get lucky. Nope, but that's okay. Really, the goal was to get him pushed back a turn, because I want to get Mr. Krabs around behind him, and we're probably most likely going to be meleeing him. So, fire on this guy. Four shots. I'm gonna warlord it up. I think it's more important that we hit this guy for sure. Not so much for the damage for Warlord, but for uh, the chance to hit. Nice. Commander. Going full okay, we're not going to be able to use everything, unfortunately. Uh, we're going to leave one ER up, but we're going to fire the rest right into this guy's back. And now he can't move, so we're coming back here. Hopefully we take him out. Well, at least we got his arm. Okay. Ouch. He's probably going first, yeah. Oh, man. Okay, so we got one more turn of full firing with cold metal. Um, I think I need to generate as many chevron pips as I can here. So we're going to move into here. And hopefully we've got enough to dump this guy on his ass. Most likely not, but we're going to fire. What are you doing, buddy? Deciding who you're going to shoot for? 
Come on. Usually there's a pause like this before they fire rocket launchers, but... He's got one wound. Come on, don't crash. Don't do it, we've been having so much fun. I'm still gonna wait. Still gonna wait. You know you can do it, you're thinking about it. You're thinking about attacking. You know, if this wasn't a game, you'd be dead. Can't think like this. Come on. Crap, I think it's crashed. Ah, having to start over will be a nightmare. Oh, there we go. Maybe it was just the sheer volume of fire. Got MGs? Wait a minute. He didn't have machine guns. You know what? They're probably down so far down the list that we can't see them. I bet you. They're pro oh yeah, I didn't scroll down. <laughs> Five heavy machine guns. Because of course. <sighs> uh we're gonna multi target this up. Okay, so we'll put a PPC on A and everything else to B, I think. We might be able to knock this guy down, in which case he's out cold. So let's fire this. Engaging multiple enemies. Or we could just take his head straight off. Okay, he's going down too. Hickory, man, that's, that's what you talk, call coming through. Pylon, step on yeah, that fucker's man. head, please. Fucking Bane Banes. Step on his head. Just do it. Do it, Bubba. You missed? Head hit? Head hit? Nope. Uh, I'm sure this guy's running XL. It's clan though. Um, we've lost. He's lost almost all of his AC2. So let's just shoot for the torso on this side. Can't fire everything, but we'll fire this. Man, this guy's almost a stick now. Sure, dude. Losing armor. It's all right. I'm happy with that. Happy with what he did. Copy that. Let's save ammo. Use all the lasers, please. And firing. Okay, I'm on it. Okay, he's going down, which means he's incapacitated. Bane, Bane, going down. Okay, there we go. That's cool, man. We only use four turn, four tons of, uh, or four turns worth of ammo. Well, at least for the uh, annihilator. Yes, command. On the move. Full speed. Standing by. Okay, I think. Do I want to get pylon to act? We activated it. No, we didn't. Okay, good. Thought there we I thought for a second there we activated it. I think what I want to do is I want Pylon further up ahead. I don't want him to be activating this. I need to have him in melee combat earlier rather than later. Yep. Most likely. Um, I think we might get Hickory to activate it. Roger. I haven't really decided yet. I think the gosses need to be a little closer. Good to go. Hickory's got those laser weapons, so that's kind of a bonus. Fast. Mr. Krabs, we got enough for 
10 more wait how many more turns of fire do we have well, i'll find out in a second Waiting for orders. let's just walk it down On my way. most likely we're going to have another uh wave here yeah. uh, let's not let's not get inside man We got 32 rounds left divided by four is eight. Yeah, so four shots per wave. Ready for order. So we got 58 rounds left divided by eight is four, seven. So let's get you down because you'll be going before the assault max. Let's get you down and we'll use, I think we're going to use Hickory to activate. Let's get our stability back. Okay, I think we're ready to activate here. Full yeah, I think we're ready to activate. What do you need? We got 10 turns of rotary 5. I think we're good, so let's move into here. Let's do this. Let's hope the guys that we just activated have got some weapons on them. There looks like they're mediums, unfortunately. Which means they could get killed really, really, really quickly. What do we got here? Axel 2C, a Stalker, and two others here. Good thing we got some evasion pips up, eh? Um, 95 tonner. And a 60 ton. Okay, not so bad. How much armor does this guy have? 225. I think we could crunch this guy without a problem if we hit him. So, Pylon, I want you to do that. I don't want this guy anywhere a, lie, a side attack, I think, for sure. Let's do this. Uh, we're going to leave the fluid gun off for now. And probably the haywire. But we're going to hit him with everything else. Moving to position. I want to save those for mechs. Okay, come on, finish him up. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's a huge bonus for us. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Which means it's four on three now. 60 ton are coming in. Okay, he's not firing, which is, uh, once again, a huge bonus for us. Uh, we want to definitely generate Chevron, so we're going to do Phantom Mech. Um... Let's see what this 95 tonner is. Okay. Full speed it is. Executioner. Two ER larges, SRMs, and Goss clan. So it's not so bad. Stalker is has got more armor, doesn't it? No. So we've got great chances to hit this guy. We're gonna take it and fire on him. I think the fact that this guy's carrying clan weapons makes him a little bit more dangerous. So he's unstable. He's going to have to move first, I think. Wow, he's got some good speed. Give him that. 52 damage. That's not so bad. But that puts us with... Yep. Let's get Hickory first. On this stalker. Roger. And we're going to shoot everything. And maybe we make them unstable. Yep. So 
So he's got to move now. He's coming in for a melee attack? Sure, why not? Mjolnir can take the punishment right now. Not forever, but right now it can. Um, okay. I want to stay out of range of that 60 tonner. I want to try and block some of these vehicles too. Stalker, I don't think it's got good back armor. No, it does, actually. Um, but, do we war yeah, we're going to confirm this. I want to do as much damage as I can early on to this guy's back. We're going to fire. Oh, we missed with one. Okay, you guys. Yeah, man. Work on what I did. Shoot him in the back. Crits. Give me some crits with those machine guns. We need the machine gun crits. Let's go. Nicely done. One more guy. Nope. There you go. Mad Dog. Okay. I think we got Mad Dog parts. Oh, shit. They penned. Shit, shit, shit. I lost the weapon. Yeah. Well, we are kind of... <sighs> Look at this guy. Order. The stalker can't go. Uh, how badly is he damaged? Oh, he's got one point in the CT. So we're going to multi-target this out. Going to fire on this guy and this guy. Uh, these are going to B and the other one to A. So let's fire. Oh. Wow, man, we blew his ammo up, really. That's the Executioner. Executioner. If you haven't seen that guy's channel, go check it out. So it's like Executioner, but with an A at the, at the beginning. Receiving you. Uh, not the best channel in the world, but pretty good for what he does. Uh, we're going to drop everything on. We're going to be doing a lot less damage, but we got to get this guy right now. Okay, come on, hit with something. Okay, good. Which means we go before him next turn. Nice. Okay, next. Yeah. Nope. Yep. Let's move into here. This guy's got to go. Firing. Okay. Then there was one. Just going to walk it down. Warlord, confirm. And... This is the other side. That's fine. All right, we're just going to fire on him. We could go for a head hit. Am I getting cocky by doing this? I don't know. Look at our chances to hit, man. Let's see if we can take his head off. That looked like a head hit to me. Yep. Come on, man. Shoot him in the head. Shoot him in the head. Oh, you knocked his ass down, though. That's good. Another pilot injury. Come on, shoot him in the head. Shoot him in the head. You know you want to. That looked like a penetration there. Was that a head hit? No. No, no, no. Cold shot head. Head. Dude. Yes, Commander. It's good to go. On my way. 
Can't fire everything. But we are going to shoot for the head and we're going to fire. <laughs> Take it. Good to go. All right, we got to get set up for the next uh, attack. Let's move. We lost the arm, but the torso is still really strong. Um, what do you need? Can you get down here, Hicks? You can. Uh, but let's not. Let's just. Uh, Let's brace there. I want that vehicle to move. You got long range weapons, so so the annihilator is still pretty fresh. Let's get him up closer to the front. We know they're gonna appear up in the top here. So I want to try and get up as far as I can so we're not facing them shooting down on us. Ready for orders. I don't think there's probably a better five skull mission we could have taken than an escort. The four on four um, is a huge adv advantage for us. I don't think we're going to get that stability back. Okay, the Annihilator didn't take any damage in that round. What are we down to here? 92 and 97. So we have to shield that torso as best we can. So let's just move it down. You can sprint next turn. I want these vehicles forward. Okay, here they go. Don't go in the circle yet. Okay, good. I don't want them in there yet, because I want at least another turn or so to get up this freaking hill. Roger that. Full speed. If we can get the jump on enemy reinforcements for a turn, and apply a shit ton of damage, I want to hide. I want you to hide back here, man. Um, if we can apply a shit ton of damage early on with Mr. Krabs and the Annihilator, I think we're probably going to be set up to uh, succeed really well here. Hickory's going to be lagging behind, but I'm okay with that. Here we go. Hold this position, I've got something. The package will be on its way soon. Two in. What do we got here? Thunderbolt, 75, 60, and 85. Okay, not too bad. At least there's no 100 tonners. Pylon. Um, Commander. Okay, Phantom X back up. We're going to confirm that. We're going to move right in here. Okay, I'm on it. And we're going to shoot uh, someone that we think we can kill here. Ryokin, what it's got? LB2Xs, LRM15s, a lot of armor. Ultra 20, okay, this guy's got to go down. Mad Dog Prime, cool looking mech, but I think this guy is the threat right now. And we'll dump everything straight into this guy. Actually, we should push him back a turn. Gonna try for the headshot, because, oh, not you. You, headshot. Let's see if we can take his head right off. Unlikely, but. Okay, got a head hit. Critical hit, Commander. You can argue that that's not fighting fair, but screw him. We're from the Unisphere, man. Why? Why would we fight fair? There is no honor among Inosphere pilots. Standing by. Uh, you're going to reserve. I want to save you for last. Unfortunately, Hickory, 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 Hickory is woefully out of position, but that's okay. Yeah, he had to move. Okay, um, let's get cold metal up here. we got to sprint it. Do we want to see what this guy is? Probably... Um, so let's move into this position here. Bing. Uh, Zeus, C. 
HA40, okay, so and the ATM, so it's not not that bad actually. I think I want this guy first. So we're gonna warlord this because I want to make sure we hit as best we can. And why are we targeting the Zeus as much as I want to kill him with a good chances? I think we got to take this guy. Or do I? Let's run the risk. Try and take the head off the Zeus. No, we missed with two. Well, that's what you get for attempting. Wow. Oh, you got my combat shield? Screw you. Look at that. Look at that arm. What do you need? Lag her behind, girl. Gotta get your ass up here. It's two more turns before she's gonna be activated here. Yes, Phantom Mac, please. Vigilance, please. And let's get in and get this guy. Oh, we don't have the range? We don't have the range, but we can get right beside him. Really low chances to hit, though. Let's do it. On the move. Okay, here's their drop ship. They should be out of here in a turn, maybe two at the most. Waiting for orders. We can't oh we can't attack this guy from behind, he's on a cliff. But this guy is available for a back attack, which we will take. Still doing 88 damage. We can't go against the Thunderbolt there. That's just suicide. God damn it. Look at that guy. I don't like him. Not at all. It's a good freaking loadout, man. I gotta say that. Chances of drop way down. Still think we gotta hit this guy though. Firing. One hit, really. What are they doing here? Yeah, looking to knock my ass on the ground. I don't blame them. Okay, we passed that though. This guy's gonna knock me down, I think. I think the mistake was not having the Marauder come up at the same time. We're missing a whole uh, mech of firepower here. Yeah, going down. Holy shit! Yeah, big mistake not having the Marauder up there. That's my fault. I was looking for some quick hits, but... Um, didn't work. Maybe this guy's in a position I can shoot him now. Aye, aye. Yep. They both are. Confirmed. Um. Let's see if we can take this torso out. Okay, there we go. Tit for tat. We got one, they got one. Thank you.
Okay. That's probably better than shooting all your shit at me, that's for sure. Orders. This guy's gotta go too. Uh, let's get our back to the wall and attack. Move order Putting my weight into it. I have no idea what I did there. Okay. I think you did too. My it's gonna force him. To, yeah, it's all right. It's gonna force him to do go next. Yeah. He's got no choice. Okay, we're out of... You got it. Yeah. We're out of, um... What's it called? Yeah, I think this is the right thing to do. I'm gonna make okay, three hits. Not bad. this guy gonna do next as long as he's just engaging in direct fire that's fine I'm okay with that hope we didn't lose that annihilator I'm here going full throttle Take advantage of this Zeus's mistake. Fire everything. Here we go. Come on, get in there. Knock him down. Knock him down. Ah. Yeah, he's got to go again. Okay, good. We got lucky. Pylon's in a bad position. Let's wait. That's the oh, there's the back there. Acknowledge. Okay, another eighty something. Okay, nice. He's just hard. taking a bit of a dirt nap. Tango down. Okay, they got this guy left. He's an ace pilot. These guys are both caught out of position now. Losing lots of armor. Thank goodness that Zeus decided to melee. I see what you're doing. Standing by. Don't think I don't see what you're doing. Ooh, I can't get behind the Zeus though. We can get right here. On my way. And I think we'll leave the ER larges off for now. We're going to fire the rest. Uh, we're going to vigilance again. Got to make sure we're going again. And yeah, firing on the Zeus. I'm taking this so is he unstable? He is. Yes, Commander. Let's see if we can put this guy's ass on the ground. Get our back to the wall. Um, gonna, just going to shoot on this guy. We're almost out of uh, ultra rounds, but we got to put this guy down, so let's do it. Okay. Nice. So we're going to be going before him next turn. Everybody will be. Could bail out of here, but that's not our style. Even if we did lose the Annihilator, I mean, I think we did pretty good in this Five Scholar. I'm pretty happy with this being the 100th episode. This guy switching to melee is a big mistake, but that's okay. He's super heated, though. I guess he had to. Um...
Let's see if we can squash this guy. Okay. I'm here. We'll go with Hickory last. No, I think we need to kill the Zeus. Let's just step out and do that. I'm dead. Go for the leg. How much do you got left of CT here? We can't kill him in the CT. I mean, we could take his head off. We could try. But at least if we take his leg off, we know he can't move around. So let's try for a leg shot. And not get it. My AC5 is empty. Yeah. Aye, aye. We had just enough ammo for that mission. Let's get into here. Understood. Moving fast. Use whatever we can on this guy. Uh, we're going to go CT. And fire. Acknowledged. Okay, he's superheated now. Hit. His turn. And then we go. Okay, he's he's coming completely ineffectual now. Uh standing by. Nope. Um receiving you. Move on out. Busting out. Shooting this guy in the back. Two ER larges firing. Pushing him back a turn. Not pushing him back a turn because I forgot to do a uh, really I meant to do a uh, offensive push on him. Doesn't matter though, they, they're they giving up here. Yes, Commander. Uh, let's go on this Zeus. Let's get him from this side. And yeah, attack. Alright, he's had it. What's up, Bubba? Let's finish this guy up and go home. <laughs> yeah! Alright, we lost the annihilator, but not bad. Alright, there it is, folks. Increase of 50%. Or, ah... It's going to cost more than that if the Annihilator is still alive. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of shiz that we lost. That's a lot of shiz that we lost. Come on. Let's see if we lost the Annihilator. Bane Prime. Uh, I don't see the Annihilator in there. So we don't. We didn't lose it. It's going to cost a shit ton to fix, though. Zeus C, AP Gauss rifle. No, ATM twelve. We got six parts. Zeus C. I mean, we could roll the dice and take six parts of the Zeus C and hope we get the last one. We got a Ryokin part. We can't finish off anything let's let's do that let's just roll the dice um, there's so much good clan stuff down here like stuff that we can immediately use like the LB2X clans we could immediately use on the Warhammer the Ultra 20 clan we could immediately use. 
Um, but this might be the last episode. So I'm thinking... Let's roll the dice and see what we get. If we can get that Zeus. A lot of stuff I'd like to have, but it's not like if we if we continue along, we can pick this stuff up later on. So let's let's do that. Let's give it let's give it a roll of the dice. Where are you here? Uh Zeus C. One, two, three, four, five, six, and let's hope for that last piece. Two parts of the bane, Thunderbolt. One, two, three, four, five, six. We didn't get it. Well, we had to try. And we got a bunch of clan stuff. Not a whole lot of good stuff, but stuff that we can, some stuff we can put to use, like the clan medium pulses we can probably put to use. Got another one of these guys. Uh, a couple of clan ER mediums. Oh, clan ER large, okay. So not too bad. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah. Look at that. <laughs> uh, we got several days, I think, before the next financial statement, don't we? Pretty sure we do. Why don't do we don't why can't we see how many days? Financial report three days. Okay, we're okay, so let's do this. <laughs> oh man that was totally worth it though that was totally worth it so we got three days before the financial report if we continue the series along that's more than enough time to pull off another cheap ass mission here or sell some GAC that we can get just a little bit more um, but that's it guys that's uh, episode 100 of Rogue Tech Cold Forge I hope you enjoyed the series um, if you guys want me to continue along um and continue playing out here like this version is not anywhere near what the new versions of Rogue Tech are like so I'm more than happy to do that but like I said it's going to be once a week most likely um, I do have the uh, Rogue Tech folder saved so I can go back to it at any time uh, Rogue Tech, or sorry the Battletech folder with this version of Rogue Tech saved uh, so I can just install it at any time and run it um, so yeah that'll be the end of the series unless there's a high demand for more of it um, but I'll keep it around just in case. Um, if you like the episode and the series, please drop a like. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Also, check out my other series that are running right now, Funky Steve's Medinas, um, which is running in vo version uh, 997 of Rotec. That series will probably be ending shortly, but I might continue along for a little bit longer. Uh, the newest series is Rotec um, Night Witches. That's running in 998, the most recent version at this point in time of Rogue Tech. Um, and I'm also waiting for uh, any sort of, uh, I think there's a few bugs in 998 right now. They're, they're still trying to iron out. Once those happen, uh, I will be running another series. And I'm going to call that series Free Birth um, or Free Births. And it's going to be starting off in the clan worlds. So who knows, maybe it's a continuation of these characters that uh, uh, either got absorbed by a clan or whatever and are basically starting off in in the clan space so yeah that's kind of what i'm planning on doing for that that'll be running in 998 as well alongside night witches uh as i begin to fade out or uh, phase out uh, funky steve's medinas so with that i'm going to end the episode here and the series here unless there's high demand like i said and until next time we'll see you later <laughs>